Hey, hey, welcome everyone. Karen Wolf here in the art studio this evening. Good to see you guys. I haven't been on here for a, a little bit uh, to paint. I was on here uh, last week to talk to you guys about what was going on in the studio. Um, we still do have, ah, we finished up uh, in the in-studio umbrella party, um, the kids Mother's Day party. Uh, but we still have the, um, the flower lady. Ah! The flower lady's coming up. Oh, let me get that circle off of there. There we go. Well, kind of. Uh, the painting's over the studio, so this is all I have. But we'll be painting the flower lady, um, on May, is it May 20th? Hold on. I'm about as unorganized as I can be anymore. Yeah, May 20th. Uh, it'll be that morning from 10, uh, 10 to noon uh, that we'll be painting that one in studio on May 20th. So that'll be real fun. It'll be on a 12 by 16 canvas. We'll be painting it in acrylic. And if you're local, you should definitely join in on that one. Um, boy, do I look tired. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, <clears throat> I didn't realize it. Uh, and I am. I've been going on wide open for quite some time now. So, um, yeah, get tired when you do that. Um, but this one, the flower lady, is going to be real fun. Uh, it's a cute painting. Um, and we'll be working on that together in the studio. So, if you're interested in doing something like that, she's available online also as an online painting tutorial. But this evening, I'm just going to jump on here and just play. I haven't painted with you guys for a while. I went on Unsplash and uh, pulled up this painting here that I'm going to do just a little. Um, we use this as a reference photo. It's a Unsplash is a website where you can go and you can uh, download photos um, for free. Some of them, some of them you have to pay for. Virginia Long, uh, Virginia Long took this. Uh, picture of this donkey and I'm going to paint it try to uh, and I think I'm going to use a palette knife I've just sketched it out, out here a little bit um, just real quick um, this evening hey Tammy you're tired too oh my gosh I am just work my out I do not um, stop uh, long enough to rest and uh, it's my own fault <laughs> I uh, I go 90 miles an hour most of the time. So I'm going to pull you guys up here on my other phone to see if I can see uh, comments or uh, see who jumps on uh, while I'm turning away from my phone uh, back here. Uh, let's see. I wasn't planning on going uh, live this evening at all, but I just, I'm going on here just real quick. I'm going to paint this little donkey. Um, just gonna see, um, there we go. Just gonna see how it, how it goes. <laughs> sometimes things go good, sometimes they don't, but we'll see. And I'm just using, uh, up some of this paint that I have here on, uh, the palette. Whatever possessed me to think I could do this with a palette light knife, I don't know, but we'll see. I'm just going to use up some paint that I have. See what we get going on. I'm going to use not black. I picked up some black there. Got it really dark. I don't want it to be too awful black. I really want some brown. Let me, let me, let me find some brown. So how are you guys doing? You guys been painting anything? Having, having a creative... Uh, moment or anything i uh i've been painting a lot um mostly creating paintings for my website for my members and my membership don't you all forget about the all access membership that is a that is a thing um painting some paintings uh i've got one over here let's see this is my new uh, online painting. It's available for the All Access members. Uh, it's in there for all the members to grab. 
uh, and it's also available to purchase on the website, but if you're in the All Access membership, you get that one, uh, and you can paint it whenever. I still can't get this light enough. There we go. Uh, whenever you want, you have access to it all the, the whole, uh, anytime, as long as you're in the membership, and, uh, yeah, fun stuff. So we'll see how this works. Uh, like I said, I am just experimenting. But always painting, always coming up with new paintings. I'm painting with the kids, coming up with new stuff on the, uh, for the website, for YouTube for the kids, for in-studio for the kids, adults. Just got all kinds of stuff going on. So, yeah, stick with me. You'll have some painting fun. <laughs> Lots of painting fun. All right. Right, Tammy? Tammy is an all-access member, and she, she gets to join in with me in the membership. I'm getting ready to do something in there with you guys tomorrow and I'm still not sure what but we will have some fun we definitely will I need to get some more white on my palette like I said I'm just using that paint um, and uh, sometimes I do that I end up with all these things and I don't think I have any white on any of them um, yeah, just painting in acrylic, guys. Just painting some in acrylic. Having some fun. Just painting along. Just paint, paint, paint. Like I said, I hadn't been on here for a while to paint anything, so I thought I would just see what we could come up with. So I go into my, like I said, I pulled this up on Unsplash. It's a pretty cool thing that you can, those artists, or uh, photographers, I mean, take uh, pictures and allow you to download them. Now they do have someone there that you have to purchase, and they're, they're some of both. Which is, which is cool too. They're just different ones. But normally, if I'm going to come in and do something, you know, like this, I'll sketch it out first, sketch it on the canvas first. Uh, I'm just, like I said, I'm just having some fun playing here. Just doing this little guy. Um, a donkey, donkey, donkey. Like, uh, I love to paint with the palette knife. It's a lot of fun to paint with palette knife. I'm having trouble with that right there. I need to move that out. There we go. And I may not finish this this evening. Um, my husband's upstairs cooking dinner. We're having hamburgers for dinner. Y'all already had dinner? <laughs> Did you have something delish? I know it's, t it's late and uh, we should have already had dinner. But sometimes that doesn't happen around here. He went fishing earlier and uh, I was creating paintings for a painting party. And, um, so, why does the 
decided to come on here and see what we could come up with. And I do not know why I just put black right there. Don't know black right there. I wanted black right here. Gosh. I'm looking at this thing and putting my paint in the wrong place. I need brown. I don't know. I need brown. Just a light brown right there. Put a little bit of white in that light brown. It's hard to see that picture. I should make it bigger. And I don't know if I did a very good sketch of it. Y'all like donkeys. Y'all like animals. I love to paint animals. Animals are so fun. Now, I'll give you this. Uh, painting an animal with a palette knife is a bit of a challenge. <laughs> oh, that sounds good. You had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Well, get yourself right over here. Well, you probably aren't hungry now. I was going to say, get yourself right over here and you can have a hamburger too. He's a really good cook. I don't know if I've talked about that much on here. But, um, my husband, Joe, if some of you may know this already, <laughs> some of you may not. Well, if you look at me, you can tell by looking at me. He's a really good cook. He really is. And he enjoys it, which just blows my mind because I don't know why anybody uh, would want to um, cook. But he, he enjoys cooking as much as I enjoy painting, I believe. So, um, there you go. He does. Uh, there's just something about uh, cooking that just, I just am not good at it. Never have been. Um, yeah, and I was telling him earlier, he used to go to my friend's house, and, uh, we would, um, when we were, when I was younger, teenager, and she would, uh, fix me a hamburger, and all the fixings, and it was so good, oh my gosh. And now I don't really eat everything on my hamburgers. But a while ago, I said, oh, no. I said that was really good then. Maybe I should, uh, maybe I should do that. Eat everything on my hamburger. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. I'm just filling in this. He has a big white place around his eye right there. And then there's a big white place on his And you just kind of uh, place the paint on with the back of the palette knife. And then I do my line. I didn't mean to do that one right there. With the edge of this. Well, I guess that does right here. Kind of does come out a little bit right there. So, hey, that was a happy accident. There. And then over here. How's it looking so far? It's looking like a donkey so far. But he is a good cook. I am not. Um, I like to bake. Y'all like to cook? Y'all like to bake. I am not too bad at baking when I want to. I used to do it more. And one thing with uh, palette knife painting also, you can't um, 
you can't try to make it perfect. You just almost just have to, you know, let the let the cards fall where they may, so to speak. And like I said, this may end up looking really ugly, or it may end up being okay. I've not done this before live, so I have painted live. You all know that many times. But I have not painted a donkey live with a palette knife. <laughs> Oh, that's for sure. So, it's going to be adorable. We hope so. <laughs> it's hard to cook just for one. It's hard to cook just for two, I think, also, uh, Tammy. Um, we waste, um, we waste more food than we eat. I tell Joe that all the time. And we both eat leftovers, but, um... It's hard uh, to eat it all. And then um, <clears throat> we uh, always say we're going to freeze stuff. And then we end up forgetting to freeze it. And then it goes bad. And then there you have that. Pretty crazy. That comes up. That comes out. There's just a little tiny bit right there. That comes up. That comes around. And two, I may have my proportions a little bit off, might not. Don't know. Don't know. Got a big dark place right between his head here. His little between his head, <laughs> between his <laughs> between his eyes. That's funny. Got a place between his head. I meant between his eyes. All right. Um, now some girls, some friends of mine too. They had gone on a trip and they went to um, a painting. Uh, little retreat thing and they painted a donkey while they were there and they were showing pictures of it and I was just like oh my gosh I'm gonna paint a donkey I started one a long time ago with a paintbrush and I need to finish it but for some reason this evening I was wanting to paint with a pile of mine We may have to finish this another day. Because it is dinner time. It is dinner time. But I, I do have, uh, like I said, the flower lady. If you guys are interested in painting her with me in studio, uh, jump on and sign up for that. She is going to be so much fun. We won't be painting her with a palette knife. We'll be painting her with a brush. And, um, I have, um, the kids' birthday parties, uh, are booming. Love them, love them, love them. If you have a child that's getting ready to have a birthday and you would like to celebrate that birthday in studio with me, I would be happy to entertain we have the kids come in. The canvas is all situated and ready to go. And the kids uh, love it. They have a really good time. Uh, they come in and um, the images are all drawn on the canvas. And um, I don't normally use black. Um, the image is already drawn on the canvas. We They come in. Everybody has a seat. We paint together for about an hour and a half. And then after the painting is done, painting portion is done, uh, then they open their um, gifts. 
and eat cupcakes and cake and have a big time. And um, they love it. They absolutely love it and want to come back. So um, it's, a, it's a lot of fun if you uh, have kids or grandkids or you know of someone that would be interested in that. Uh, it is a big time. It's a, it's a lot of fun. We have fun with that. So, um, and for adults too, I can do, um, I'm getting ready to do an adult, um, private event this weekend. A group of folks get together, getting together and, um, kind of a family thing, a Mother's Day weekend event. They're coming in. We're all going to paint together. Sometimes I get quiet when I paint. And I'm really up close into this, so uh, I'll have to step back and look at it from a distance to to get a get a good look at it and see what I need to change and what uh, you know it was out of out of kilter or what's not out of kilter what. What, what? Okay. It's fun. I don't know if it looks good, but I'm having some fun. Okay, let's see. I need some blue. We're going to put some gray. In here on his nose, and then that's going to be white under there. It's coming together. It is coming together. And like I said, we're going to probably have to call it a... Call it a day here. This is fun. It doesn't really matter whether it looks good or not if you're having fun, right? <laughs> uh, let's see if I get some light in this guy's eyes. Gotta concentrate. Concentration.
And like I said, with palette knife painting, it's not something that you need to be uh, working on trying to get everything just exactly perfect because you're not going to be able to get it um, to be that way. It's not going to happen. Um, because, I mean, there's certain things that you just won't be able to fix. Uh, just like you do with the brush. But it's still, it's a lot of fun. It really is a lot of fun. And it uh, is something that definitely takes practice. You gotta practice. Of course, you have to practice with the brush. I mean, you have to... You have to practice with the brush to get it to look... Uh, to get better at it. And that's the same way that you have to do with the uh, palette knife. But it's super duper fun. Super fun. His eye over here. I'm having trouble with this eye. So I think I've got this too big. And that too. Something. They're off even. They're uneven or something. So I'm going to have to wait till that dries or something and work on that a little bit. Because if I try to do it while it's wet, it's going to just make a holy mess. Like it just did right there. Okay. Well, that's a good start on in many ways. Um, it's sure... Like I said, it sure is fun. It sure is uh, a lot of fun to do this. And we've got a ways to go yet. So, all right. But we got a good start. Right? Good start. Okay. So, he's coming. Can you all see? Move that. He's coming along. His eye, this eye is just a little, a little big, I think, is what that is. What that problem is. I don't know if I can. Or maybe that comes down. There's not much space between there. No, that comes down. Watch me touch it with my finger. I've got the habit of doing that when I when I paint with the brush. All right. Well, we're going to let that go. We're going to stop there. And we will continue on uh, next time. How about that? Hey, Lori. <laughs> Has this been done? Yes, all with the palette knife. All with the palette knife. It has <laughs> this evening. <laughs> oh, gee, Bunny. Uh Why I do the things I do, I do not know. But um, I don't know. I just got in my head I wanted to paint a donkey. And um, I don't know why I decided I wanted to paint it with a palette knife. But hey, if you don't do it, you won't know if you can so, here we go. He's real cute so far. Um, but, like I said, I'm going to have to stop um, and uh, continue on another time. So, this is part one of Painting the Donkey with Palette Knife. Thank you all so much for joining on. Uh, joining in. To <laughs> Who knows what I say. Um, but the um, reference photo... Oh, down in there. What was that? A marker? The reference photo was uh, Unsplash uh, website. Virginia Long was the uh, photographer for this one. And Unsplash is a website that you can uh, go on and uh, get some free downloads of photographs for people that uh, take them. I'm not sure what I'm going to do for the background with this one since I'm painting it with the palette knife. I'm not sure. 
Do y'all have suggestions for, uh, he's kind of, I've run out of room down their bottom. I'm not sure that I would make him looking over that. I don't know what I'll do for the background. Just something simple. I don't know that I'll do that. But anyways, I really appreciate uh, her uh, photography. So we'll give her credit for that. Um, yeah, that was a, that was fun. That was fun. I really enjoyed that with you guys. So thank you all so much for jumping on here with me. If you're watching the replay, um, thank you for jumping on uh, and watching that uh, later. I know some people can't jump on when it's live. Uh, we'll finish this and do a second part. Um, pretty sure we can finish it in two. Um, so thank you all so much. Appreciate you. Uh, God bless you. And have a wonderful, wonderful evening or rest of your day or whatever you're doing. And I'll see you back on here next time. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.